going to come off that losing streak here tonight. Ontario being a bit of a pest there in that Pacific Division. As here's Blackwater, a shot on Nick Goldie with a rebound shot, and he scores! Judd Blackwater, new line, no problem. Flares the puck off the pads, and Goldie shoves it home. 1-0 Las Vegas. Yeah, and a great start, Ian. We wondered what we were going to see here uh, early, and we talked about him in the pregame show. Ash Goldie right there, number 15. And, and I like what you said. Blackwater didn't have the option for the great shot. He actually almost plays a pass off the pads. Pitten, <laughs> Pitten makes a good save, makes the save, but a juicy rebound like that. That's never going to be a, a good spot to have a rebound, as you see right here on the rebound. Pitten tried to go and sprawl out, but there's nothing you can do. Can't fault the goaltender. He made the no. first save, but when you've got Ash Goldie sitting in the slot with the 4 by 6 like that, that is deadly, especially early in the first. Bar hasn't helped. one nothing Las Vegas as we approach the halfway mark. Intercepted by Bakersfield in the offensive zone. Shot, fan on shot again, and they score. Second chance shot, and it's number 15. Robbie D with the first goal for the Condors tonight. 1-1 the score. Well, and there you have it. Maybe that's just what the Condors needed. A little bouncing puck ends up on the uh, stick of the left-handed shooter, and you can't fault the goaltender with that one. Fallon uh, had eyes on the initial shot. Only the Condors' second shot of the game, though. But uh, you touched on Freeman. We're definitely going to keep an eye on him. But the rookies, the rookies for the Condors, we're definitely going to keep an eye on that. But already here, eight minutes into the game, Ian, we've already had a goal for a goal. He keeps his arm stapled down by his side, though. Shot from the point, bounces off the pads of Fallon and in. 13.02 the time of the goal, and Bakersfield jumps out 2-1. Oh, that's rough right there, Ian. That is rough. You can see the Wranglers all skating over the bench, but the thing they got to do is keep their heads up. The Wranglers have taken a ton of shots. The opportunities have definitely been there for the Wranglers. The Condors so far tonight, their two goals, uh, uh, that one was a little bit juicier, a little bit better. A slap shot from the point. You remember the first goal from Robbie D was just a bouncing puck. Uh, but once again, can't fault the goaltender Joe Fowler on that. Slap shot from the point. Comes through and gets deflected, but the Wranglers definitely need to keep keep the wheels going on what they were doing. Nothing uh, was wrong with what just happened there. Miller, just outside the circle, will take this one himself. He's got Medill at the point, but he likes to go all the way back into the offensive zone. So nice stick work here by Miller in front. Score! Scotty Campbell, the soup is warm. The number 14 nets his seventh of the season. 2-2 two two the score here from the Orleans. Go ahead, Ian. You can call me psychic. It's okay. I told you the Wranglers were going to get one here, and, and that's just why. I told you the Wranglers stayed hungry. Did you see that play, though? Miller literally just did about a 540 in the Condor zone. He had free reign. He started off behind the net. You'll see it right here, Pitton, and he actually cruised all the way up to the point. Didn't leave it at the point. Goes all the way back around the right wing. <laughs> Ends up behind the net again and then just chips it right to the net. That's why you throw... That's why you throw the puck at the net. Ian, we control though, and here comes Bakersfield. Pushing forward is Boyd. Boyd, centering pass, bounces off the pads of Fallon, and it's in. Puck was bouncing around in the crease. Fallon could not locate it, and Bakersfield was able to bang it home. 3-2 now. Condors on the strength of Robbie Dees. 11th of the season. Make it a hat trick. Robbie D on the board once again. Faceoff coming to the stick side of Pitten. Ash Goldie in to take the draw. He wins it. Leaves it for Goers. Goers now pinching in forward behind the net. It's Blackwater. Blackwater feed pass for Goers. A shot up high. He scores! Barry G -G Goers ties the game for Las Vegas. 3-3 here. 10-41 remaining in the third. Barry Goers. His first of the season. To go along with seven assists, make it eight points, and it couldn't have came at a better time. Ten minutes away, and Las Vegas ties it up. The Wranglers have been working around the net the whole entire game. He's trying to find an open man, and they just completed it right there. 10.37 left now in the third. We got a tie game. We were tied after one. We were tied after two. And now midway through three, surprise, surprise, we're tied again. Time couldn't keep this one in, though. Two-on-two two rush. Here comes Bakersfield. Controlling it is Boyd. Boyd, a shot right there. Blocked away nicely by Goers. He's had a great game so far for the Wranglers. Here's Miller now. Three-on-three three for Las Vegas. Over to Weston. Weston rips a shot. Bouncing puck in front. He scores! <laughs> a second.
second chance drive for Las Vegas. Scotty Campbell. Mm -mm, good. Las Vegas on top, four to three with 15 seconds remaining. I said it for Bakersfield, and I'll say it for Las Vegas. When Bakersfield scored their second goal, their first goal of the first, and then the second, right after that, the second goal in the second, now Las Vegas has done that now as well in the third. So, wow, what a momentum swing going for Las Vegas. Scotty Campbell looking like Bobby Orr there. Left the feet <laughs> after the shot, hands in the air. Boy, oh boy, you talk about timing. It is everything. 15.2 seconds left in the game, and Scott Campbell with his second of the game. The sky's the limit for that kid as far as the rest of the season goes, if he can keep those legs churning as he has all season long. Face-off won by Las Vegas. Hitting just outside the crease. He'll probably exit if Bakersfield can clear it. A shot on it off the post! Las Vegas nearly gave up the equalizer. But as they say, the Irons, a goalie's best friend. An early Christmas present for Joe Fallon. Gift wrapped by the crossbar. Four to three, the final. Las Vegas takes down Bakersfield. And they used every minute of those 60 hockey minutes. 15 seconds left. They netted the winner. Scotty Campbell, his second of the game. His eighth of the season. And what a goal it was.